so much to my fans. Anything I'm looking forward to seeing tonight? Oh God, so many things. Um, I'm looking forward to seeing all the musical performances. Um, I think Eminem and Rihanna are gonna be super cool together. And Keep knocking, nobody's home. Sleepwalking, we just been playing with the voice in my head saying, let's shoot the messenger, we're just friends with them. 21 Pilots, um, my friend Debbie Ryan is actually dating the drummer and I saw them perform recently at House of Blues and they're awesome, so good luck to them. Uh, what are we looking forward to seeing other than our performance? Not much. Uh, well, I, I hate I hate cats that smile, so if there's like a, a little like more like grumpy or frustrated one, I'd be happy to see that. If there was one here. Are you talking uh, about the grumpy cat? I might be talking about the grumpy cat. You'll see, you'll, it'll make sense. Yeah. Um, Channing Tatum's obliques are gonna be here. Who else is obliques? Uh, Conan might go topless at one point. I don't know, do I have the inside scoop? Maybe. Shoot 50 celebrity cameos. It's, it's fine, I mean, this is just like a quick cameo thing. You just- Yeah, I mean, it can be as long as we want it. All the live performances. Yeah. Live performances. yeah. <laughs> and then Channy taking that Trailblazer Award, yeah. wrapping it up for the Step Up uh, cast. Yeah. Not even known it. And when I think about what's gotten me from here, sorry, what's gotten me from there to here, it really has to do with you guys. And I thank you. Uh, am I presenting? I don't know, man. I don't know. I'm just going to tell me what to do backstage at the, at the last minute, and then I'm going to go out and do something completely different. Yeah, yeah, I'm presenting uh, Best Kiss tonight. Uh, should be interesting. Uh, I'll be up there with Zach and Seth and uh, who knows, maybe some man-on-man -man love. Uh, no one's really told me what's going on, so it should be weird and raw and unexpected, yeah. That was pretty good. We won. We won. Yes. <laughs> Congratulations. Yes, it was. It's very, very cool. You know, I've always wanted to get a nice big golden popcorn, and now we got one. So, and thank you to all the guys. Nice and from this is the end. Thank you for having us in the film. Thank you, Seth, Seth's wife Lauren, for making that call. So, thank you guys. What can we expect from your performance? Fire. Music. Unicorns. Emotions. Love. Unity. Fire. Sushi. Respect. And uh, trust falls. Surprises. A foundation of trust built between us and the audience. And rainbows. What makes the movie awards different? Well, I think because it's MTV, it's, it's more fun, it's more edgy, and I don't think anybody really takes themselves too seriously, which I think is cool. It's way more fun because, you know, I mean, although that bucket of popcorn is pretty important, uh, it's not all about that. It's about the camaraderie and also they serve booze. So that's, that's a huge plus for me. I think the MTV Movie Awards is different. Uh, it's just like more relaxed. You know, I'm wearing a t-shirt. Uh, everyone's screaming. Uh, well, I mean, it's, it's not something that I'm very used to. Obviously, I'm not in the, I don't, I'm not an actor. I don't do films. But I'm very, I'm very excited to do something that's a little bit different, and um, and uh, I think it'll be a bit more exciting for me because I've no idea what to expect. This is the best. This is the most fun, man. We have the most fun here. People get a, have a good time. Doesn't take it too seriously, but you know, it does take it seriously. It's like great categories, like you know, best movie of the year. But there's also really like funny stuff too. So you know, uh, this is like, this is the, this is my kind of award show. I, I mean, this is my first ever experience, so it's hard for me to kind of say, but um. A WTF award, I mean, that's pretty special. Um, you know, uh, yeah, I mean, best shirtless, that's equally another very special award. And again, happy to be a part of that nominated category. So, yeah. 
the fun energy that we have here is amazing. I mean, as soon as we stepped out of our car, you know, people streaming and, and whatnot, which we will get at other places, but yeah. it's just alive. You feel alive. I don't know. Yeah, it's a younger crowd and I don't know, it's less serious, I feel like, but you still have the same type of people showing up. Well, mm -hmm. considering this is one of our first award shows we've ever been a part of, who freaking knows, man? No, uh, I'm sure... I'm sure that this is something that, I, I, anytime that you celebrate something that has anything to do with art or expression, um, we're big fans of because, honestly, expressing ourselves through art has helped us in a lot of ways personally, and anytime that's celebrated, whether or not all of the, all of the antics that go on around it make sense, uh, it's still, it's still a good thing. I have these thoughts so often I act to replace a slap with what everyone's back Cause somebody stole my car video and now I just sit in silence. The cast, I can't see all the cast members because if I miss someone, they'll like kick my ass later and I don't want to deal with that. We also want to congratulate Jennifer Lawrence. Yeah. For yeah. taking home the popcorn for best female performance for Hunger Games Catching Fire. Thank you very much. Um, we just obviously want to say a huge, huge thank you to all you guys, first of all, first and foremost. I want to say real quickly, um, I know that if Philip were here, he would, uh, he would really think this is really cool. And, and to have him in our movies was one of the coolest things in the world. He's one of the actors I've looked up to my entire Actually, life. I'm excited to be a part of the MTV family now. Um, I have a show called Eye Candy, which is going to air early next year, I believe. And um, yeah, it's something totally different for me. It's a, it's a bit more mature and darker and a little bit twisted. So it's going to be very cool. Uh, Neighbors is coming out in a few weeks, uh, which is going to be amazing. Seth Rogen, Zac Efron, Rose Byrne. A uh, lot of male nudity, uh, basically pushing the envelope as far as you can without making it NC-17. It's going to be awesome. Uh, and then 22 Jump Street, um, I, have a, I have a quick cameo. I was only there for one day shooting, but it was, uh, it was the weirdest day I've ever experienced in front of a camera, which is saying a lot. I've done a lot of weird things for the internet, so hopefully a very memorable scene. We'll see. Um, I am about to start shooting a few movies, Pitch Perfect 2, and uh, this movie called The Final Girls, and do the next season of my stand-up show, Adam Devine's House Party. And I will be back on Modern Family, I think, yeah. And Timo Season 4, doing it again, Sall saddling back up to ride the wolf. Set of Austin Alley is literally the best set anyone could ask for. Um, so thanks for Kevin Heat for the gig. And uh, thanks for all the fans who's voting, and I know who you are.